you love cookies. In this video, a brand new delicious restaurant in Brookhaven with all you can eat burritos. Run on down today and stop into this wonderful new restaurant, Los Pancho. Daisy! Come down here, we're going out to eat! Bring all your money! Oh my god, would you look at this place? And the smell! Ugh, bean burrito heaven! With the extra beans? Yes, please, I'll have one of those. Uh, yeah, I think I'll do the all you can eat burritos too. Buddy, you gave up already? I'm still eating my bean burritos. So many burritos! Yes. Ew, Molly, that smells terrible! <coughs> what do you mean it wasn't you? <coughs> and why is there a green cloud around you? Welcome back to Channel 3 News. This is Brittany reporting live from downtown Brookhaven. We are under attack. Fart attack! I urge you, stay inside. Welcome to Channel 3 News. I'm Brittany, and I'm here in front of the brand new Los Panchos restaurant. Um, Miguel, would you like to tell us what specialties you, ha you have at your new restaurant? Yeah, um, well, we have all-you-can-eat burritos. I think those are going to be the most popular. All-you-can-eat burritos? That sounds delicious. What do you put in the, the burritos? Well, beans, um... Beans, uh, rice, more beans. Beans are delicious. I couldn't agree more. Beans are delicious. And cheese, uh, and whatever you want. Chicken, shrimp, ah! uh, yeah, pretty much anything. And of course, my family's very secret ingredient sauce. Ooh, tell me what the ingredients are. Didn't I just say? It's a secret family recipe. Ow. Oh, I know, but you could just whisper it in my ear. We're live on the news. I'm not going to tell you what the secret ingredient is. Oh, well, what brought you to Brookhaven? Um, well, uh, we were in Blacksburg, but we just felt Brookhaven was definitely going to be great for us. I mean, we did go out of Blacksburg with a bang, though. Well, you heard it here first. A brand new delicious delicious restaurant in Brookhaven with all you can eat burritos. Run on down today and stop into this wonderful new restaurant, Los Panchos. Are you kidding me? OMG! All you can eat burritos? Ah, uh, today just happens to be the most bestest day ever of my entire life! <laughs> Daisy! Come down here, we're going out to eat! Bring all your money! Oh my god, would you look at this place! And the smell! Ugh, bean burrito heaven! Welcome to Los Panchos. <laughs> oh, what can I get for you today? A seat! <laughs> Preferably one that has a lot of wiggle room, since I plan on eating bean burritos till I explode. My sister loves bean burritos. I love them. I love them. I love them. I love them. You guys can sit over there at the booth if you like. Thank you. Um, so I'll bring you a menu in just a minute. I'm just doing a takeout order. No problem. We'll wait. Molly, you're very excited. I can't stop smiling. <laughs> burritos. All I can eat. Thanks for waiting. Since I did that news segment, I've been so busy with customers. Wow, that's great. Well, we're so glad you went Brookhaven. Yeah, so glad. Can you feed me all the burritos now? All right, let me just tell you my specials. I do have some fiery enchiladas. Ow. Ooh, sounds good. Or you also can get the all-you-can-eat burritos with extra beans and my family's secret sauce ingredients. Ah, oh, secret sauce. I bet that's delicious with the extra beans. Yes, please. I'll have one of those. Uh, yeah, I think I'll do the all you can eat burritos, too. Sounds good. I'm extra hungry today. Okay. I'll be right back with your order. So excited. Molly, what are you doing? You don't dance on the table in a nice restaurant. <laughs> I'm just so excited. And I just can't hide it. I'm about to eat burritos and I think I like it. Molly, get down. You embarrass. 
embarrassing me. <laughs> I can't even explain how excited and happy I am. Burrito! Uh, could you please get off the table? Oh, yeah, sorry. Your bean burritos just are making me so excited. Dee Dee, look at all these bean burritos. And tacos, too. Mm. This secret sauce with the extra beans, it's really good. It's a little spicy, though. I don't mind spicy. Mm. Oh, so good. A few hours later. Molly, you gave up already? I'm still eating my bean burritos. So many burritos. So many. Uh, Daisy, today was the best day of my life. Uh-oh. Uh, uh what is it, Molly? Molly? What? I just ate a bunch of bean burritos. Emphasis on the beans. Yeah. Ew, Molly, that smells terrible. Kind of need to go potty. Come on, let's run home super fast. <coughs> Molly, wait up. Can't have to go potty. <coughs> A few minutes later. Ah, the toilet. Finally. Daisy, get out. I'm going poo poo. I have to go too, Molly. That secret sauce made my stomach really weird. Get out. Wow, Sam, this was the most delicious dinner ever. What a nice date. Yeah, I really enjoyed my time, Stephanie. Um, maybe we could go on another date? Yeah, I'd love that. Uh, ew? This is our first date. Uh, uh it wasn't me. Ow. <coughs> what do you mean it wasn't you? <coughs> Why is there a green cloud around you? Um, uh, I guess we can't go on a second date. Bye! Ah! Ew, gross. It smells so bad. Ugh. Wow. Ugh, that bean burrito from Los Panchos is giving me an upset tummy. Mmm, Doritos. Excuse me, I'd like to get some Doritos. Why are you putting me in your cart, crazy lady? Hey, don't be rude. <laughs> Did you just fart at me? Well, I have news for you, lady. I ate a bean burrito today, too. I'm so glad I got the job at the supermarket in my retirement. Everything here smells so delicious. And it's almost my lunch break. Mm. Welcome back to Channel 3 News. This is Brittany reporting live from downtown Brookhaven are under attack. Fart attack! I urge you, stay inside. The residents of Brookhaven have gone crazy, and everyone is farting. It smells very bad. Stay inside and close your windows. Daisy, would you look at that? Brookhaven looks gorgeous. Buddy, this is a real problem. It's like a fart plague. Yeah, Maybe we should call it Burrito Haven or Fart Haven. <coughs> Maddie, this is no joking matter. I'm not joking. I think it's fabulous. Burritos for all. Maddie, get in here. You're going to let that smog in and that toxic smell would never get out. <coughs> um, uh, uh, what, Molly? Does this mean we don't have school? Yes, it's going to mean the school is closed. Yes, we're farting. Everybody, more farting, more farting, more farting. Can't even believe this person is my sister. Uh-oh, Daisy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what, Molly? Oh, don't tell me you have to make a fart. Uh, Molly! Uh, Molly, hold it in. You're going to make the toxic waste inside of our house. We want to keep it outside. I'm trying to hold it in. Ugh, my stomach! It's gonna explode! I don't care, Molly! I don't wanna smell it! Keep it in! I'm trying to keep it in, but my stomach! Ugh, it feels like it's gonna explode! I don't care, Molly! Now hold it in! Oh, oh, ah! <sighs> Did it go away, Molly? Um, Molly! What's that smell? Uh... Five minutes later. 
Is it good? Uh, no. <laughs> there, I'm all done with your hair. What do you think? I look like a Sharpay dog. Ugh, it's terrible. That's it. <laughs> How dare you fart in my salon? <sighs> Serves you right. Look at this ugly hair. Ugh, terrible customer service. One star. Hey, can I have a turn playing that game? No, my quarter hasn't run out yet. I'm still playing. Well, I want to play. Too bad, I'm playing. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Ew, gross. That smells really bad. Celeste? Celeste, where are you? I'm here, Mommy. Celeste, there you are. Hurry, we have to go home. Why? I was playing at the arcade. Did you not notice the arcade? It's full of toxic stink. <laughs> All of Brookhaven is under attack. Fart attack! Come on, honey. We need to get home right away. Oh, wow. Does that mean everybody's farting uncontrollably? That's exactly what it means. Exactly what it means. Oh, well, sorry for this, then. Oh, no. Not you, too, honey. even up yet. Good morning, Molly. I made your favorite pancakes. Hey, we why aren't you dressed for school? Mom, Ugh, I am dressed for school. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. Good morning, Daisy. Wait, neither one of you are dressed for school. I'm wearing this to school today. What? Molly, Daisy, you, you can't wear pajamas to school. I was up all night studying. Jeepers, this new science teacher gives us tons of homework. Even a ton of homework for me, and I'm super smart. I don't even have the energy to put on regular clothes. Oh, kids these days, wearing pajamas to school? Molly, well, your pajamas don't even match. Ow. Huh, what? I fell asleep standing up. Ugh, oh, I guess as long as you're wearing clothes, that's all that matters. Well, take your pancakes and get off to the school bus. What? We can't even sit down to eat them? No, you girls are going to be late. You're going to have to eat them at the bus stop. Oh, what'd you say? I'm still half asleep. Molly, wake up! Ah! What are you doing? Well, now you're awake. Oh, my sister is so annoying. Bye, Mom! Molly, you forgot your pancakes. Oh yeah, my pancakes. Oopsie. Good morning, class. Whoa, what are you all wearing? Um, our clothes? Those don't look like clothes, class. Why are you all wearing pajamas? Well, we had so much homework last night that we're all exhausted. So we just rolled out of bed and came into class. I just think, like, I don't have to dress like up every single day to still be popular. I'm still the coolest girl in school whether I wear pajamas or not. This is getting totally out of hand. You guys are not allowed to just wear pajamas to school. I'm going to talk to the principal. Principal Snyder! Principal Snyder! Where is she? Principal Snyder? What? What? What is going on? Principal Snyder, are you sleeping on the job? Uh-oh. Uh, uh, sorry, I just needed to chill out for a little bit. What is going on with this school? First, the students are all wearing pajamas, and now, and now you're taking a nap and wearing your pajamas? Well, the job is kind of stressful. Uh, what are you talking about? We just got off a summer break. You're just back at school right now. How can you be tired already? We've had a three-month vacation. I don't know. It's just, uh, this job is so, well, jobby. Look, I think that we need to all start dressing up and doing our jobs. Oh, I don't know. That sounds boring. I'm the principal, so what I say goes. Well, if you don't, I'm quitting. What? You quit your job just because you don't want everyone to wear pajamas? 
Yeah, I would! Attention, students! Attention, students! This is your math teacher. From now on, you will dress to impress. You have exactly 30 seconds to change, or you're going to get in-school suspension. The theme is preppy, awesome student. Go! What? They can't tell us what to wear. Apparently they can. And if we don't do what the teacher says, we're going to get in-school suspension. Ow. Well, that won't be anything new for you, Molly. You have detention like every day. <laughs> not in-school suspension. Besides, I don't have any preppy clothes. I, I, I'm not a good student. But I am. Come over to my locker where I have some extras. Oh, thank goodness for you, Daisy. Ugh, whatever. I don't need to dress that way. Well, if you don't, you're going to get in-school suspension. Okay, I have something for everybody to wear. But we have to hurry up. We only have 30 seconds. Daisy, if you think I'm wearing that, you're crazy. Well, you have another choice, Molly. Now put it on before you get in-school suspension. Oh, I feel like I'm dying on the inside. Oh, Molly, quit being so dramatic. That outfit's so adorable. Oh, I hate it. Well, I think my outfit's wow. pretty cute. I know, right? I have adorable fashion sense. Oh, it's terrible. Oh, look at you guys. Well, it's an improvement, but not perfect. What do you mean not perfect? These shorts are giving me a wedgie. That's how much I, I, I was willing to sacrifice to wear this ridiculous outfit. Whoa, Molly, be careful. You might get detained. Wedgie! 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 Oh, these are so uncomfortable. Well, Molly, you're not wearing any shoes. How could you come to school with no shoes? Shoes are a requirement. Well, having a brain is a requirement, too, but I don't see Molly having one of those. Ooh, Daisy! Why, I oughta. Molly, please sit in your chair. Ooh. And... And what's going on with you, Sarah? You're not even changed. I put on sunglasses. Isn't that good enough? Obviously, this negative reinforcement is not really working. When I said you had in-school suspension, I thought you all would dress like a preppy, awesome student. But I guess not. I've been trying to lead by example this whole time. I mean, look at my outfit. Perfectly preppy. Perfectly boring. Perfectly lame. Perfectly barf worthy. Ooh. So I think I'm going to give you some positive reinforcement. This should motivate you. The student who wins the perfect outfit doesn't have to do homework for the entire week. Attention students, attention students. Whatever student wins most awesome outfit next doesn't have to do homework for an entire week. <gasps> That's right, no homework for an entire week. The next theme is nerdy. Well, that's it. Daisy doesn't have to do homework for an entire week. Everybody knows nerdy is her middle name. Well, I am smart, but I still think I'm a fashionista. Huh? Fashion famous in Brookhaven? I'm not even good at playing fashion famous in, well, fashion famous. Oh, no. Okay, I, I can do this. I, I don't want to have to do homework for an entire week, so I need to win. I need to win! How's this? Not nerdy enough. And also, where are my pants? <laughs> these glasses are so nerdy. Ow, ow, I can't see anything in these glasses. And I still am not wearing any pants. I'm totally going to lose this competition. I can't dress to impress anybody. What do we have here? Fashion roadkill. <laughs> Oh, laugh it up, Daisy. Laugh it up. But these nerdy glasses are hard to see through. I mean, they're like the bottom of Coke bottles. Other people actually see with these. Because their eyes aren't good, Molly. So that's their prescription. Well, I don't need a prescription. Well, you better learn to like it, Molly. Because nerds, they need glasses. Go away, Daisy. I have to figure out how to look nerdy. Well, first you can stop by wearing some pants. <laughs> Time's up, everybody. I hope you dressed to impress, Brookhaven edition. Wow. Up first, we have our most amazing student, Daisy. Let's see your nerdy style, girl. 
As you can see, I know a lot about being a nerd, but also fashionable. <laughs> Vote for me! Impressive, Daisy. Impressive. Next we have Brookie. Let's see what you got, Brookie. Are you nerdy or a loser? And by loser, I mean you have to do homework for an entire week. Uh, uh, wow. Uh, Brookie, uh... Yeah, I know, right? I'm the nerdiest of the nerds. Wow. Actually, I think Spock from Star Trek is probably just, well, dorky, not nerdy. Next up, we have Sarah. Let's see what you got, Sarah. Uh, yeah, uh, so I'm just like, well, not really nerdy. <laughs> uh, Sarah, your outfit's terrible. You look like a baddie. You look like a baddie that, well, bullies nerds. Please go sit down. Ugh, I didn't want to go to this competition anyway. And last up, we have Molly. What? <laughs> I was actually busy reading a book, so I didn't hear anything you said. Ooh. Molly, the book on your head actually says how to read a book written by me. <laughs> what are you talking about? I've been reading since I was born. <laughs> Look at my awesome outfit. Look at all these books and, 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 ow, I ran into my desk. I can't see in these glasses. But don't worry. My eyes will get worse as I'm wearing them, and I'll be the nerdiest of the nerds. Well, I'm glad to see that you all aren't wearing pajamas, so win for me. But let's talk about who won no homework for a week. In third place, we have Dave. Are you kidding me? I have the biggest Blaine in this entire school. That by default makes me the nerdiest. Ooh. Well, your outfit is, well, not as impressive as others. Sorry, third place. And in second place, we have Brookie. Whoa, I didn't think I would get any placement. Well, <laughs> we didn't really have a lot to choose from. Ooh. Uh, well, thanks, I guess. And in first place... If I don't win no homework for a week, Molly, and you get first place, I'm gonna bully you. Molly, you're our first place winner! Congratulations! No homework for a week! And also, I don't want to sit in detention with you for a week because you didn't do your homework. Ooh. Holy guacamole! <laughs> I won! I won! No homework for a week, dude. No homework for a week, do da do day. I can't believe this. Ugh, this is so lame. You're just jealous because I'm the biggest nerd of all. <laughs> That's right, loser. You are the biggest nerd of them all, which means now I'm going to follow you around all week <laughs> and bully you. First up, time to get stuffed in a lot. Get in there, loser. Uh -oh. But, but, but I won the competition. Yeah, which makes you the prime candidate for me to tease you and bully you. Sarah, let me out of here! <laughs> nah, I don't think so. I'm gonna eat your lunch. Oh, man, I don't want to be stuck in here. Let me out, somebody! <laughs> <laughs> to do over here would anyone like to help me but please sorry honey but this awesome show is on and <laughs> it's super funny hey we were supposed to watch that together as a family well mom it turns on at exactly seven o'clock and you're still doing dishes so sorry you have to miss out Ooh. Mm, annoying Ugh, i finally got baby kira down for the night now i can get some vacuuming done um, girls, would you mind picking up all of your stuff? Uh, Mom, uh, we're eating a snack right now. Correction, Molly, you're eating a giant snack. Molly? Wow. Oh, that was the ham that I was going to use for tomorrow night's dinner. Sorry, Mom, it looked like it'd make a delicious sandwich. <laughs> Boy, was I right. Okay, well, the show is off now. Maybe you guys can help me pick up a little bit, you know, after you eat that giant sandwich, Molly. I'm kind of feeling hungry for a sandwich, too. Would you make me one, honey? Uh, uh, Please, I'm so hungry. Me, too. You guys hardly ate any of your dinner. 
That's because, well, um, it was kind of... What she he's trying to say is, bleh, it was gross. Yeah. Oh, Molly, I wasn't going to say it that way. Fine, I'll make you all snacks since my dinner was so gross. Are you guys happy now? Mmm, this popcorn's delicious. Mmm. Dad and I are eating sandwiches that are bigger than us. I see that. <laughs> it's so good with the mustard. Mmm. Kira woke up again. Honey, is baby Kira okay? Yeah, she just needs another bottle. Wow, that kid is an eating machine. Yeah, she must be having a growth spurt. Finally, the kids are in bed, so now I can play some video games. Video games? Ugh, I don't get to have that downtime. Why not? You just have to take it. Yeah, apparently. But I don't have time to take it. I didn't get the chance to mow the grass today. You're gonna mow the grass at 9 o'clock at night? I don't see where I have a choice. Everything has to get done. <coughs> Adulting. <sighs> this has been the longest day of my life. <sighs> Is that the sun coming up? <gasps> Did I mow the grass all night long? Oh my gosh. Today is going to be now the longest day ever. Ooh. Hey, there you are. Mom, we're just waiting for breakfast. Um, you're five minutes late. What? I was up all night doing chores and mowing the grass and, and, and now you want breakfast? Uh, yeah, you are mom. Uh, of course we do. Oh. <laughs> no need to cry, mom. Just make breakfast for us, please. Yeah, honey, we're starving. That's it. I have had enough. Oh, I'm so sorry, but I'm not feeling so good. <gasps> what? Honey, are you okay? Uh-oh. No, I have to go sit on the couch. Oh, oh no. Who's going to make us breakfast? You'll have to make them breakfast. But I always burn the toast in the toaster. Sorry, honey, but I think, um, I need to run to the bathroom. Mom? Oh, that was the garage. Oh, what am I doing? Where's my bathroom? Honey, are you okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Okay, I'm just going to fake throwing up. Here we go. Blah! 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 Yeah. Honey, are you throwing up? Now, I have to grab some pillows off of the bed. <gasps> Perfect. <laughs> They'll never know. Honey, are you okay? I'm just not feeling well. I'm gonna lay in bed. Honey, are, are you feeling okay? Do you have the stomach bug? It's it's the morning. You're you're supposed to be getting up now. I know, I just don't feel well. I feel like I did when I was pregnant with baby Kira. <gasps> Wait, what? What's that bump underneath the blankets? Honey, can you get out of bed for a minute? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Honey, why are you laying in bed? It's almost time for, for work. I, I, uh, uh, I, I, uh, uh. <laughs> You're really struggling today, even more than me. Uh, are you okay? Oh, he's planking. Um, yeah, uh, honey, you are taking a nap when you're not in bed. I think you might be, well, freaking out. Yeah, y you look pregnant. Oh, well, maybe I should take a test. So, honey, what were the results? What happened? Well, I went into the bathroom and took a test and, well, yes, I'm pregnant. Oh, this is actually amazing news. I'm going to be dead again. Ah! You sure are. Wait, what? <gasps> Another baby? I hope it's a boy this time. What are you girls eating for breakfast? Hot dogs. It's all dad could make. What? All you have to do is put the hot dog in the microwave. It's breakfast, okay? La, 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 gonna be a dad. Oh, yeah, gonna be a dad again. Oh, yeah, gonna be a dad. Wait a minute, diapers? So many diapers? I don't think about that. I'm gonna be a dad again. Gonna be a dad. 
Well, now that I'm pregnant, obviously I can't do all this work around here. Wait, what? <gasps> what? What? That's right, you guys are gonna have to do all the cooking, all the cleaning. I'm just gonna have to sit here and rest. But honey, but, but... No buts. Pregnant mom needs to rest. Gotta take good care of baby. Okay, we'll try our best to do everything around here, right girls? Well, we'll try. Uh oh Wow, this is a ton of work. I know, tell me about it. Look at all these dishes. Mm-hmm. Tell me about it. Honey, um, can I wash these white socks with this uh red shirt? No, absolutely not. Didn't you ever learn how to do laundry? Not really. First my mom did my laundry, and then you! Well, and now's the perfect time to figure it out. Mom, I'm making the grocery list. Is there anything you would like? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I'd like some chocolate ice cream. I would like some peanut butter cupcakes. Wow. I would like some chocolate chip cookies. Whoa, can't tell you're pregnant or anything. <laughs> Gonna put on about 100 pounds this time, huh? What? I will not. Oh, whoops, wrong thing to say. Gotta take the trash out, bye. Who locked the door? I gotta get out of here. My wife's gonna, she's gonna kill me. <laughs> Mom, um, so what else do you need for the groceries? Ah, just those things. Surprise me with the rest. Wow, it's been like nine months since I faked my pregnancy. I guess I better stick some more pillows in there so it looks more accurate. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do just fine. Honey, I'm home from work. Where are you? Oh, I was just in here taking a nap, you know, resting for the baby. Whoa, there you are. Oh, my God. What's going on with your stomach? What do you mean? <laughs> you know I'm in my final trimester. Honey, I think you might be having twins or maybe an alien. That's a giant stomach. Oh, I just want to touch the babies inside your tummy. No, 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 no. No touching my tummy. <laughs> the babies won't like that. Babies? Do you know something that I don't? Yes, honey. I went to the doctor today. I'm having twins. Ah! Oh, my God. I know, honey. Don't freak out too much. Come on, let's go have dinner. Mm. This light bulb needs changing. I'm still doing dishes nine months later. Oh, everybody, you're eating off of paper plates from now on. Holy macaroni and cheese. Look at the baby bump. Oh, my God. Mom, you're going to have like five babies in there. Maybe they're puppies. <laughs> Daisy, Mom can't have puppies. Well, that's what they look like when a mom and dog's going to have like 15 babies. Okay, okay, quit teasing your mom about her big fat tummy. What? No, it's the old baby. It's all baby. Okay, let's have dinner, everybody. Uh, Dad, are you making us dinner? Yeah, Dad, are you making us dinner? Oh, no, not again. <laughs> oh, I don't seem to fit between the chair and the, and the table. <laughs> My baby bump is squished. Be careful, honey. If you slam their heads up against the table, you might give them brain damage. You better sit on the couch. Okay. Here you go, honey. A nice, nutritious meal for the babies. I even put some cookies on there. Ooh, watermelon. My favorite. Oh. These pillows in my shirt are so uncomfortable. Ugh, and I shouldn't have eaten so many Oreos for dessert. Oh, my stomach really hurts. Well, honey, did, did you say your stomach really hurt? No, no, honey, go back to sleep. I'm fine. No, honey, I can't go back to sleep. It's been nine months and your stomach hurts. You know what this means. Come on, we have to go to the hospital. I didn't think about this part where I'd have to go to the hospital and actually have the babies. What are you talking about? Of course you're gonna have to have our twins. <laughs> That's why you've been sitting around for nine months. Uh, yeah, uh-huh, sure, L let's go. Oh, I can't get up. The babies are too heavy. I'll just have to stay here. Honey, seriously, get out of bed. We have to go. Come on, honey, sit down in this wheelchair. 
I don't think I need that. I'm feeling fine. It was probably just a fart. <laughs> no, it's not a fart. The babies are coming. Come on. We have to get you inside. Ooh, I can barely move this wheelchair. You've put on a lot of weight with this pregnancy. What? No, no I haven't. Honey, look at your tummy. Of course you have. Get out of the way. Pregnant woman on board. Twin babies. Honey, I think that I'm just fine. Like, I... Uh, I don't think that I'm pregnant anymore. Honey, you're so pregnant you don't even fit into the elevator. I don't think so. What? But, no, I, I think it just might have all been gas. For nine months and your stomach looking like that? I don't think so. You're having these babies, whether you like it or not. <laughs> Who's this kid? Are you an intern? No, I'm your doctor. Wow. Now, what seems to be the issue? What do you mean, what seems to be the issue? Can you not look at her stomach? She's about to have babies! Okay, miss. No jumping around. Where are you going? <gasps> I don't think I need to have babies anymore. She's lost her mind. The babies are made her crazy or something. <laughs> Honey, get in here. You have to go into the labor room. Oh, God. How am I going to get out of this now? I mean, oh, my gosh. Uh, I'm not actually pregnant. What am I going to do? Okay, I'm just going to examine your tummy a little bit. Please hold still, Miss Acker. Oh, your stomach feels very funny. Let me give it a little push here. Oh, <laughs> a little pregnancy gas, I see. See, I, I don't need to have babies. I just had to fart, that's all. Honey, quit being so ridiculous. You're going to have twins. It's going to be okay. You've had, you've had, you know, other kids. You're going to be fine. Hmm. Your tummy seems very peculiar. Um, uh, Mr. Acker, would you go get some coffee, please? It's going to be a pretty long night, I think. Are you going to be okay, honey? Yeah, I'll be fine. <laughs> the doctor will take good care of me. Okay. Now that he's gone, spill. Ow! I can see that there's just pillows stuffed up your shirt. Well, um, um, let me guess. He overworks you at home and your kids don't help or pitch in. Yeah? How did you know? I see this with women at least three times a week. <laughs> now, I'm just going to tell your husband that it was a giant gas bubble that's been trapped in your stomach for nine months. <laughs> don't worry. We'll just emphasize that he doesn't have to change any dirty diapers. Oh, thank you. You're the best doctor ever. Honey. Did you have the baby while I was out getting coffee? You weren't supposed to do that. Where is the baby? Um, Mr. Acker, we need to have a conversation. Oh. Oh, what? Did, wait, why is that cat in here? Did you give birth to a cat? What? Honey, have you lost your mind? Of course I didn't give birth to a cat. Oh, it's an angry cat. Kind of glad it's not our kid. Mr. Acker, your wife had a serious case. Of gas bubble. <gasps> Wait, what? Where, where's my twin babies? There are no twin babies, honey. I just really had to fart. Wait, what? But, 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 cute little names. I put them out. Well, Mr. Acker, just think about it. No dirty diapers, no added expenses. This is going to save you so much time and money that it was just a fart. Honey, that was a big fart. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> You could have just taken some gas X at any point in the nine months. Mr. Acker, I think your wife mm, probably got intense bouts of gas because she was forced to do all the work at home. That would give anybody indigestion. Uh-oh. Oh, oh I, I didn't think about it like that. Uh, I'm sorry, honey. That's okay. You can make it up to me by getting me some flowers, getting me some DoorDash, and starting to help more around the house. Don't worry, honey. I will. But do you still want to have twins? Um, we'll think about it. Thanks, doctor. You're a real lifesaver. Mmm, this pizza looks delicious. I can't wait to devour all of it. Girls, are you ready? Ready to what? Eat all this delicious pizza? Molly. It's 7 o'clock in the morning and you're eating pizza? Yeah, haven't you ever heard of breakfast pizza? It's delicious. Ah, Molly, don't eat that entire pizza. You know you're going to get a stomach ache and we have to do back to school shopping. Why? I think I have plenty of good clothes. Molly, 
That shirt right there has so many bean burrito stains on it. It's disgusting. Yeah. You need some new clothes. Ugh, I don't like back to school shopping. I love back to school shopping. Like it's literally my favorite time of the year. Of course it is, because you have to look perfect when you go back to school. Well, yeah, of course. I get good grades. I'm a fashionista. It's just who I am, Molly. I am the person who eats all this pizza. You. Molly, say excuse me. Um, excuse me. I'm busy fitting this whole pizza in my mouth. <laughs> hey, guys, it's me, Molly, and today I'm doing back-to-school shopping. Wait a minute, I have a little bit of pizza sauce on my face. <laughs> um, and I don't know what I'm going to get yet. Probably a new backpack um, and stuff like that. Okay, um... Wait, is there something that they sell at the store, like at Walmart, like like a robot that'll do your homework for you? What? <laughs> yeah, wait, Molly, you kidding? No, I'm serious. I need to invent like a robot that does all my homework. Oh yeah, yeah, Molly, you're so lazy. Ooh, yeah, 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 but Olympics. Olympics. Sorry, sweetie, but you can't watch gymnastics right now. We have to go back to school shopping. Oh, Molly, I'm on my TV. No, sweetie, that's enough TV for one day. Five minutes later. Come on, baby Kira, aren't you excited? We're going for a ride. No, I'm on my Olympics. Come on, girls. Molly, what are you wearing? My pajama bottoms, duh. Molly, you can't wear pajama bottoms. Why? Everybody else at Walmart does. <laughs> All right, baby Kira, time to get in your car seat. Molly, why'd you open the trunk? She can't ride in there. Oopsie. <laughs> I kind of didn't mean to. Ooh. Mom, why does Daisy get to ride in the front seat? Because I'm cooler than you. Daisy, that's so rude. Why would you say that? Well, the truth hurts, doesn't it, Molly? Girls, no fighting. <sighs> Especially since I have to be stuck at this red light with you guys. I want my Olympics. Um, baby Kira is gonna say that all day long. Mom, what are you doing? Um, I accidentally ran a ran a red light. You guys keep fighting and and, and I couldn't pay attention. Oh yeah, sure, blame the kids. Something's wrong with our car. Nah, it's just Roblox. It's a little glitchy today, but don't worry, we'll get there eventually. One eternity later. Ooh la la, I want to go in here. Why would you want to go in there? There's not even anything for back to school. Yeah, Daisy, everything in there looks pretty expensive. And boring. Uh, are you feeling okay? Yeah, um, I, I think so. It's probably back to school shopping. She doesn't really like it. I need to buy a diaper change. <laughs> what? I don't need a diaper change. I'm a teenager. Ay, ay, ay. All right, Daisy, you can go in for five minutes, but I'm not going to promise you I'm buying you anything. There's not even any backpacks in there. I know, but look at the designer purses. They're so cool. <sighs> Only $500. Ow. $500? Are you crazy? Yeah, but it'd be worth it. Even Sarah would be jealous of me then. Yeah, Mom's never going to buy that for you. <sighs> My stomach feels kind of weird. I'm going to tell Mom you ate that entire pizza. And then you're going to get in trouble because you have a stomach ache and you ate too much, which you told you not to. You better not, Daisy. You're such a tattletale sister. Oh, you're so annoying. I'm annoying. You're the one that looks like you're gonna buff everywhere. We're supposed to be having a fun back to school shopping experience. And here you are, looking like that. Rude! I'm going outside. Mom, Daisy's being rude to me. Oh yeah, who's the tattletale now? Molly ate too much pizza. Now his stomach is. Oh, seriously, Molly? Ugh, I told you not to eat that entire pizza by yourself. I told you she needs a diaper change. <laughs> we do what you do, what you do. Baby Kira, no, don't play in the fountain. Baby Kira. Don't worry, Mom. I'll get her. Baby Kira, you're being so naughty right now. Naughty, naughty baby. Okay, girls. Let's get serious about actually shopping for back to school. How about we go into chic? Ooh, chic. Sounds good to me. Ugh, look at these clothes. They're so boring. I want one that had baby shark on it. 
Uh, baby Kara, you're not even going to school. <laughs> what? I'm not going to school? Uh, Ooh. Don't worry, baby Kara. You'll be going to school soon enough. And then you'll wish you could go back to, well, just watching cartoons all day long. What do you guys think of this? I think it could be cute. Ugh, gross. Molly, try to be nicer to your sister and go try on some school clothes. I told you, I'm just going to wear this. Molly, you're not wearing pajama bottoms and a stained shirt to school. Okay, fine. Ugh, mom has got to be kidding me. This is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Molly, are you... Oh, whoopsie! Daisy, I'm not wearing any pants! Oh, uh, sorry, Molly. Ugh, this day keeps getting worse and worse and worse. Molly, are you done trying on those outfits? Ugh, yeah. Come on, let me see it. What, what are you... What are you wearing? I decided to put all the outfits you gave me on at the same time so I don't have to keep coming in and trying them on, trying them on, trying them on. Molly, you can't just wear all the clothes at once. And Daisy, you're not allowed to wear that. What? Why? Because I said so. Go back and change. I am fine. Oh, that makes one of us, baby Kira. Mom, my stomach kind of hurts. Can we go home? Oh, honey, I know you don't like school back to school shopping, but you can't get out of it by just saying your stomach hurts. I'm not just saying that. It, it really does. Ow. Hey, we're in a store. I'm like, I couldn't help it. <laughs> Sorry. Ugh, Molly, does your stomach feel better? Not really. How about this? Wow. No, Daisy, that's too grown up for you. I am grown up. I'm not a baby anymore. Yeah. Molly, go back into the dressing room, please. Ugh, I don't feel so good. Why'd I eat that whole pizza? Ugh. <laughs> Molly, can baby Kara play on your phone? She's getting impatient and my phone died. Yeah, I guess. Oh, Daisy, now that's better. Very rock and roll. I know, right? I'm going for a slightly different look this time. Ugh, look at me. I, I look like a nightmare. What? I think you look beautiful, Molly. Ugh, no, no, and also, no. Now, this outfit is perfect. <laughs> Are you serious, Molly? Are those like emojis on a toilet? Yeah, with toilet paper and everything. It's hilarious, right? <laughs> well, it is pretty cute, but I don't know, Molly. They may complain at school about you wearing that. I don't know why, Mom. Everybody poops, you know. <laughs> oh, gee, thanks for the reminder, Molly. I had totally forgotten that. I had to love you full, Molly. I want to keep it. Yeah, no, you're not keeping it. So, Mom, speaking of keeping it, can I buy this shirt? It's the perfect first day of school shirt. <sighs> okay, Molly. Hooray! <laughs> Back to school shopping isn't so bad, I guess. Ay, 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 Molly. <laughs> you have a weird sense of fashion. I know. But it's unique to me, isn't it? I mean, seriously. Slam the like button if you think this is the cutest shirt ever. <laughs> oh, girls, you did really well today. You each got a few new outfits. And now we'll go over to Walmart and get some back-to-school supplies and we'll to pick up some groceries for dinner. Ugh, my stomach's really hurting again. Molly, you just like the emojis on your shirt. I'm about to go poo-poo. <laughs> Ugh, I don't feel so good, Mom. Well, there's no bathroom at Chic. You'll have to wait till we get to Walmart. Oh, God, I don't know if I can make it. Molly! Sorry, my tummy really hurts! Mom, how much longer till we get to Walmart? I have to go real bad! Uh, I don't know, Molly, maybe another 10 minutes? Ah, just pull over! I wanna poop in the grass! I wanna poop in the grass! <laughs> Molly, you can't do that, you're not a dog! Oh, my stomach hurts so bad, and we're hitting every red light! Step on the gas, Mom! Sorry, Molly, I'm going as fast as I can. Ah, okay, I have to go inside. Bye. Ah! Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Sorry, um, the bathroom's being cleaned right now, so you can't go in there. What? Oh, is there another bathroom? No, they're both being cleaned right now, so out of order. You'll you'll have to like wait. Hey, 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 hey. Um, please let me go in there. There must be one toilet available. No, sorry, it's cleaning time. None of the toilets are available. Ah! I have to go potty. My stomach hurts. Oh, I shouldn't have eaten all that pizza. What's wrong with me? I had Snapchat. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Honey, don't panic. I have a, I have a solution. You do? Is there another bathroom here? No, but I've got a pack of diapers for you. <laughs> what? That's not funny. Daisy, seriously? Oh, God, what am I going to do? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, Uh -oh. Clean up on the child care aisle. Clean up on the child care aisle. Oh man, not another turd in the diaper aisle. Oh, they don't pay me enough money for this. Seriously, I should get a raise. There's the girl who pooped her pants. Oh, I'm so embarrassed. Oh, I'll never be seen as Walmart ever again. Mom, I can never show my face in public again. Ugh, Molly, this is why I told you not to eat so much pizza. You gave yourself a stomach ache. Ugh. It's just two Walmart workers, honey. It's not like they go to school with you. Everything's going to be fine. Ugh. I hope so. I'm so embarrassed. I I got my Snapchat. Wait, what? I put that on Snapchat. You did what? Yeah, I knew fault. I took a Snapchat. With me doing what, baby care? With me doing what? Would you make your poo poo at Walmart? Ah! Why am I getting a snap from Molly? She's a total loser. <laughs> Molly pooped at Walmart? <laughs> loser. I'm going to send this to everybody at school. <laughs> what a baby. <laughs> So, Brookie, what did Luke say after you told him that? Oh, he didn't really say anything. He kind of just ran out of the room. Oh, my gosh. Daisy, why are you on my bed? Um, Brookie, I gotta go. My sister's being annoying. What? I am not, Molly. Okay, Molly, well, try not to fight too much. I love you both. You're both my best friends, and I want you guys to get along. You don't have sisters. You don't know what it's like. Daisy, why are you on my bed? Um, because, Molly, um, I accidentally spilled water on my sheets, and my bed is wet. I don't care. This is my bed. Get off of it. It's my property. Molly, I'm studying for my science test, and it's very important. Besides that, Dad's downstairs running the vacuum. I can't study down there, and I can't sit on a wet mattress. Ugh. Why do I have to share a room with my sister? That's it. I've had it. Mom! 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 What is it now, Molly? Oh, my gosh. I'm washing these dishes. Mom, I want my own room. No, I need my own room. Well, Molly, there's only one bedroom for you and Daisy. One for baby Kira, which you don't want a room with her because she's up half the night crying and needing a diaper and a bottle and... Ah! Why can't I have my own room? I'm the oldest. You got your own room. No, correction. I have to share it with your dad and he snores and talks in his sleep. Sometimes he even farts in his sleep. Ew, gross. Look, Molly... This is the house that your father and I can afford. Yeah, and it's great, isn't it? Even as an elevator. I never thought I'd live this amazingly. Oh, man, this house is great. Well, it doesn't seem that great to me. Why don't we buy one that has a, my own room and Daisy has her own room? Molly, you obviously don't remember what our first house was like. Yeah, Dan, she was too little. <laughs> but I remember that house like it was yesterday. Baby shark doo 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 doo. Baby shark doo 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 doo. Molly, be quiet. I can't hear Coco mowing. No, I want to sing it. Baby shark doo 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 doo. You're super annoying, Molly. Oh, you're super annoying. Okay, girls, that's enough fighting. Come on in the kitchen. Your mom and I are making something delicious for dinner. I kind of hungry. Me too. I'm kind of hungry too. What are we having? Oh, look, girls. It's taco night. Are you excited? I'm excited. Are you excited, Molly? What's wrong, Molly? Why the sour face, honey? Oh, I don't want to eat any tacos. What? Why not, honey? You love taco night. It's so much fun. You get to make your own taco, and then it tastes so delicious, it goes into your tummy. I don't want to put anything in my tummy. Oh, do you have a tummy ache? Yeah, I have a really bad tummy ache all of a sudden. I think 
I think I need to go sit back down and watch Baby Shark. Oh, I think she just wants to watch Baby Shark instead of eat dinner. Um, Dan, you obviously don't know our daughter. <laughs> Her want to watch anything over eating tacos? I don't think so. She loves tacos. I really don't think she has any desire to eat dinner. She just acts like she doesn't feel good. Oh, my tummy really hurts. Oh, honey, I'm going to go get you some medicine, okay? And you can drink some Pepto-Bismol, maybe to make your tummy feel better. I don't want to take medicine. I don't like medicine. Okay, honey, here's some Pepto-Bismol. I'm not taking it. I'm not taking it. Molly, come on. Be brave. Take deep breath. You can do this. Come on, Molly. You can take the medicine. It's okay. <laughs> I don't want it. I'm afraid. It's going to taste yucky. I'll give you a um, prize. Do we actually have a prize? Oh, no. I'll have to look around and see if I have a toy or something that we forgot to give her for her birthday. <laughs> Just take the medicine, honey. Your tummy really hurts. Ew, it tastes gross. I know it tastes gross. Hey, look it. Look what I've got. I took my medicine so I get that cute little monkey, right? That's right, sweetheart. Oh, here you go, honey. You can have the monkey. Thank you, Daddy. It's really cute. Oh, no. With the monkey, my tummy doesn't feel so good. Uh-oh, honey. Do you need the pukey bucket? I didn't miss the bucket! I didn't miss the bucket! I didn't miss the bucket! Uh-oh, she can't throw up. Oh, boy. Looks like somebody might have the stomach bug. Oh, no. If she's got the stomach bug, it means we're all gonna get the stomach bug. Not me. I'm not gonna get it. Oh my god, my tongue green! Oh man, she must have a fever. She's got it really bad. Well, I just gave her the medicine, so hopefully some of it stayed down there before she threw up. Don't worry, Molly. Pepto-Bismol always makes me want to throw up, too. It tastes terrible. I don't feel so good. I ain't gotta go to throw up my taco. Ew, gross! That's so disgusting. Ugh, man. Can't even move off the couch right now. Tommy hurts so bad. Oh my gosh, they both have the stomach bug, Laura. We're doomed! What are you wearing? I'm getting my hazmat suit and uh, my face mask and uh, um, uh, I need to get some hand sanitizer. Oh, honey, I think we're probably gonna get the stomach bug too. You know how that germs happen. The stomach bug is relentless. And we only have one bathroom! Ah! Wow, Mommy, I never thought we'd be so sick that we'd match the couch. I know, we're so sick we turn green. Oh, I have to try to make it to the toilet. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't make it. Oh, I gotta change my clothes again. I hope you hurry up in there, Dan. I, I need to throw up. I need to use the bathroom. I gotta go potty. Me too. Why do we have a house that only has one bathroom? <laughs> oh no! Oh! My turn! I have to go potty next! I'm not gonna wait either. I have to go so bad. Wait, where's the potty? There it is. I forgot for a minute. It's because I'm so weak from having the stomach bug. Oh! I just, I just throw up in the shower, I guess, you know. Cause... <laughs> Girls, can you hurry up? I need to use the potty again. I'm not done in here. <coughs> oh, man. I think I'm going to throw up in the sink. Oh. <coughs> Are you girls almost done? I have to go to the bathroom. <coughs> no, never mind. Too late. And that's why we saved up to buy a bigger house. We needed more than one bathroom. Holy guacamole, that sounds awful. Yeah, this house was really expensive. Brookhaven is, well, very expensive to live in, and so we did the best we could. But rest assured, if you ever have to go potty because you have the stomach bug, there's more than one bathroom. <laughs> yeah, too bad there's not more than one bedroom for me and Daisy. But I'm thankful and grateful that you guys bought us such a nice house to live in. I guess I am pretty lucky. Aw, thanks for saying that, Molly. Well, I better get started on dinner. Dinner? What are we having? Are we having tacos? I never want to look at another taco again after that day. Me either. Love tacos. 
I know, but your father and I can only have tacos like once a month. Every time we think about them, it's like, oh, I'm reliving that throwing up thing all over again. Anyway, we're having nice, healthy, delicious salads. Oh, salad. Oh, no, honey, what's wrong? Are, are you getting a stomach bug again? No, I just can't stand the thought of another salad. Oh, oh I'm with Molly. I'm having a hot dog. See, dad's eating hot dog while I gotta eat salad. I don't wanna eat salad. Dan, we're setting a good example for the girls. Stop eating the hot dog. You're not the boss of me. I can eat a hot dog if I want to, unless you can catch me. Oh, wow. So grown up of him, huh? Yeah, well, you just can't make your father eat healthy. You just can't. <laughs> It's me, Laura, and please slam that like button if you want a delicious cookie. So today I am doing um, my night routine. I have three daughters, one baby and two school-aged girls, and they're going to be home from school any minute now. So I have to make dinner. I have to give my baby a bath and, you know, just like do mom stuff. But I'm pretty excited because I love my life. Um, baby Kiro, you're not really supposed to be jumping on the couch. Okay, well, I guess I get it. I mean, the floor is lava. Watch out! Mom coming in! Oh, you play full of lava with me. I get oh. oh my god, don't touch the floor, baby Kiro. It's gonna turn into lava! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Uh, uh, Bab, what are you doing? Looks like she's just sitting around. Mom, you have the easiest life ever. What? No, I was just taking a break because I was playing Floor is Lava with baby Kira. Baba, da, 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 baby, give a boy to Abby. Um, Mom, do you have a snack for us? We're super hungry. We didn't even like our lunch today. Sauerkraut sandwiches. Uh, Molly, I don't have a snack, but I'm going to be making dinner soon. And also, you might want to get off the floor. The floor is lava! Um, well... I'm a peel, and I'm going to eat an apple because I'm hungry. Okay, bye. Okay, Molly, you can have a snack too, but it has to be a healthy one. Um, what about a candy bar? Molly, did you even pay attention in health class? Of course you can't eat a, a candy bar. It's not healthy. Okay, what about a cupcake? Also not healthy. What about a taco? Molly, we don't have tacos. Eat a banana, an orange, or an apple. Oh, you can eat this lemon over here. <laughs> Ooh, a lemon. No, Molly. Okay, baby Kira. Floor is lava is over. Floor is lava never over. <laughs> oh. yeah, I like Coco Melon. Um, not right now, baby Kira, because if you watch Coco Melon, I'm pretty sure that um your mommy's brain will explode. I've heard way too much Coco Melon this week. But mom, I want to. I know, but not any more TV today. Why don't you um, play with your toys in the playroom? I want you. I'm bored. Oh, you have so many toys, baby Kira. You could just pick one. Mmm, this is good. Molly, I said no cookies. But, but this cookie was just looking at me and it was like, please eat me. My life will be fulfilled if you eat me, Molly. Ugh. Oh. Molly! Okay, I'm not gonna let this get me down. Okay. <sighs> Deep breath. Still a good mom. Still a good mom. Being a patient mom. Being a nice mom. I eat cookie too! I eat cookie too! What? Everybody put down the cookies! Hey everybody, I just want to show you when your mom goes crazy over eating cookies. <laughs> what? No! No, don't, don't put that on Snapchat. I was doing my own Snapchat of night routine and I was um, not freaking out and acting like a crazy mom. <laughs> Well, you better try harder than mom, cause you definitely freaked out about the cookies. Well, and for good reason. I told you no cookies. You guys can wait for dinner. Sheesh. What are we having, mom? Um, I'm looking now to see what I have. Um, ooh, that looks pretty healthy. Some green beans and chicken ah! and boring. Oh, girls, I'm making dinner. Why don't you get your homework done? All right, let's put this in the oven. And set that at 375. Perfect. Hey guys, it's me again. I'm just snapping um, my night routine. And um, I just put in some delicious and healthy food into the oven mm. for myself and my girls. 
My husband has to work late tonight, so he won't be home to eat right away. And Girl, I'm making a snap right now. Okay, I'll be right back. What are you doing? The big Billy Lab. I'm trying to do my homework. Have a nice party. Girls, not right now. Molly, you need to do your homework. How do I have a damn party? Look at my mood. Whoa, my head is spinning around. Holy fuck, a holy. like this um maybe go up to your room and do your homework there fine hey, mom you want to have a dance party um no i'm just gonna chill here and watch you guys while dinner's cooking For baby Kira. Oh, and the dinner's done. Well, I'm starving. When's dinner gonna be done? Molly, get out of the refrigerator. Molly, do not eat another chocolate chip cookie. Seriously. But it's so good. Ugh. Molly, put that down, please. We are having real healthy dinner right now. Where? I don't see anything. My plate's empty. Ay, 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 Molly. <sighs> So this is the next part of our night routine. We're just eating a delicious, healthy dinner. And I want to show you all of my family because they're so cute. Whoa, close up on my face. Whoa, okay, I'm still learning how to use Snapchat. There is my adorable baby, baby I got to get back to die, your boyfriend. And here's Daisy. Oh, she's eating her dinner too. It's super good, thanks, mom. You're welcome, honey. And then here is Molly. Why isn't my phone working? Okay, wait. Ah, close up of my face! Oopsie. All right, let's turn it back around. And there's Molly. Molly, why are you on your phone? Why aren't you eating? Um, well, um, you're on your phone. Okay, yeah, good point. I'll tell you guys the next part of my night routine when I get there. Molly, no phones at the table. But mom, you were just making a Snapchat. Just this one time, okay? Because I was trying to show our night routine, but, but, ugh, off your phone. I did it, but I died. That was super good, Mama. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, sweetheart. So, how was your school day, girls? Well, I didn't get detention, so I'm thinking I did pretty good. Yeah, that's a new thing for you, Molly. It's probably because we had a substitute teacher. <gasps> oh, you did? Did you like your substitute? Well, she didn't really make us do a ton of work, so I guess that was great for Molly. Um, okay, so Molly, how was your day? It was it was really good, Mom. It really was. I didn't like lunch, but other than that, it was a good day. And Daisy? Uh, yeah, I don't know what it's like when we have a substitute, because I actually like doing work at school, so I just feel like we're lazy. I didn't think about it, Baby Kira? What are you doing? Baby Kira? <gasps> Baby Kira, get out of the washing machine right now! Oh, thank goodness I wasn't Snapchatting this. <laughs> you naughty little baby. What are you doing? I got outside. No, it's too cold to be near the pool. Baby Kira, do not, do not get in that pool. Okay, I'm gonna pick her up because she just cannot behave. Obviously, she cannot be left alone right now. I want you to sing me a song. Okay. Sure, honey. You are my sunshine. Special mom and baby moment. I'm singing her a song. You are my sunshine. You make me happy. You do the dishes, Daisy. I don't want to do them. It's not my turn. Um, one moment. This special moment is not going to be ruined. I promise. You are the laziest sister ever. No, you're lazy. No, you're lazy. Girls, I'm right in the middle of this special moment on my Snapchat. You are my sunshine. I cannot believe you're going to make me do the dishes. Okay, I'll come back for the next part of my night routine. Girls, stop arguing. Daisy, you wash. Molly, you dry. Try not to argue. Because if you do, you're both getting a timeout for an hour. No Roblox. 
All right, Daisy, now this is serious. We have to get along. All right, baby Kira, let's go give you a bath. You've got a bunch of your bottle on you. We have to change your pajamas and give you a nice warm bath. And then I washed your sheets today. So you're going to have a comfy, cozy night's sleep. Look how cute your crib is. <laughs> okay, guys, so I'm back on Snapchat to show you more of my night routine. This is my cute little baby. She's hiding behind Aww. the hair. How adorable is she? Are you playing peekaboo? <laughs> So I'm gonna give her a bath right now, and then um, let's do silly faces, though, baby Kira. Oh my gosh, she was so cute! Ah, that's so adorable. Okay, so I'm gonna um, put her in the bath and get her tucked in for a sweet night night. All right, sweetie, I filled up the tub for you, so I'm just gonna put you in, and you can play around, okay? Go ahead, your rubber ducky's in there. I did that by the duck. Ooh. Bob, Belly's chasing me and I'm gonna hide, okay? Ugh, don't you girls have some homework? I already finished mine. Tell Molly she needs to do her homework. Ha ha ha! Gonna get you, Daisy! Ah, oh, Molly, you sprained me! Ha 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 ha! You're all going down! Ha ha ha! Molly, go do your homework. Seriously. Oh no! I accidentally left my Snapchat on! Um, hi everybody that watches Mom's Snapchats! Molly! I was trying to show our perfectly wonderful, sweet family night routine, and then and, and, and I just freaked out instead. Um, well, uh, okay. Let's just get reels right now for a minute, people. I want to make this a real Snapchat about real life, not just like this polished look at my life where everything looks perfect, because the truth is, is when you're a mom, Nothing is ever perfect. I mean, I have two daughters. Sometimes they fight. I have a baby and wait What yeah. is, what is that smell? Ew! Gross! I'm out of here! Wait, wait where's everyone going? What, what is that smell? Ugh, something smells awful. Ah! Ew! Baby Kara! Oh! Dobby, I go by! Oh my gosh. I and my room get in the diaper. <laughs> um, yeah, you missed the diaper, baby Kira. Oh, I tried to have a good night, but apparently I, I, ah! Mom, where are you? This duty really smells bad. Mom's not home right now. I'll leave a message after the beep. Beep. Oh, I'm just going to stay here in the laundry room. And ate this cookie. And, 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 and try to calm down. And, and hopefully the girls won't find me for at least five minutes. Because I gotta be honest, my night routine on Snapchat is, well, crazy. <laughs>
Well, if you want to have a sleepover, we need to go into the grocery store and get some snacks. Oh, you're the best mom ever. Can we also um, just order a pizza too? Sure, I don't see why not. Extra cheese? Okay, don't push your luck. Oh, come on, it's extra cheese. Everybody wants extra cheese. Ooh, Doritos! Ice cream, Mom, ice cream! Baby Kira, I thought you were gonna stay in the car. I like to go grocery shop, but I big kid now. I just eat it one day. Cause I have some Doritos. No, honey, you don't even have a bunch of a bunch of your teeth in yet. How are you gonna chew them? Cause I big girl, I can do it. No, baby Kira, no unhealthy snacks. You're still doing a lot of growing. You're just a toddler. Yeah, baby Kara, she doesn't let you eat. Mom, stop putting me in the car. I'm not the baby here. <laughs> well, quit getting in front of the car and it won't happen. Duh. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> anyway, um, she never let me eat um unhealthy snacks either. Uh, when I was your age, baby Kara. I mean, once in a while I snuck them, but Molly. Well, I'm just telling you the truth. Sometimes I just wanted to have a candy bar. Ugh, self-checkout. Ay, ay, ay. Mom, you don't like self-checkout? I remember a day when someone actually worked at the grocery store to check out my groceries. Now everything in Roblox is automated. I used to like to talk about the weather with the person checking out the groceries. Okay, Mom, I'll just get the grocery bag. Don't go crazy or anything. Come on, baby Kira. I like it in the, the passenger seat because I would ride there. No, baby Kira, you're too little. I'm too little for everything. I'm sick of being too little. Mom, what are you doing? Oopsie, got in the wrong seat. <laughs> that happens to me so much in Roblox. Yeah, it's like you can't control you where you want to sit. It's kind of crazy, actually. So Molly, what games are we playing tonight? I'm going to have a sleepover too. Can I go? Um, no, honey. This is just for the big girls. No sleepover for you. You have to be in bed by 7. What? I don't want you to get in your but I want to go to the fun sleepover. No, baby Kara. You'll just be annoying because you're little and, you know, that whole thing. Like, you annoy us because you, you like, talk too much. Mommy, don't be rude to your baby sister. Well, it's true. We don't want to talk about, like, which pacifier is her favorite. I get the pink one as my favorite. Exactly my point. I have mixed snacks for the sleepover. Sorry, baby Kira. Uh, this is a big kid job. Yeah, why don't you go watch some Coco Melon? I'm too big for that. I want to watch it. I'm too little for everything. I'll show them. Da, 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 da. So anyway, Sarah said it's school today that I farted and I wouldn't do that. Oh, Sarah is such a bully. Just try to ignore her, Daisy. I know, right? Why would she say that? Probably because she was the one who dealt it. And then she tried to blame it on you. Hey, I didn't eat any bean burritos today. Definitely wasn't me. <laughs> Hello? Hi, Jade. It's me, Kira. I go to the daycare with you. Oh, yeah. Hi, Kira. Hi, could you ask your mommy if you could come to my very first sleepover? It's happening tonight. Yeah, hold on. I asked my mom. Mom! Whoa, that was really loud. She said I could come. Okay, great. I'll see you in one hour. Bye. Okay, so Jade is coming. Scribbling her name down here. I'm not spelling it. I just can't draw a picture of her. Okay, now I call Tyler. Hello? Hi, Tyler. It's Baby Kill. You want to come to sleep over in my house? It's my first one. We're going to eat cupcakes, I promise. I asked my mom. Hold on. Mom! She said I could come. Yay! I'll see you here in one hour. Okay, Tyler can come. And I'm gonna call Olivia now. Hello? Hi, Olivia. Wanna come for sleepover in one hour? I'd love to. I'll see you then. Bye, Olivia. Perfect. Now I just need to go and steal some snacks. Oh, look. They won't even know I'm here. <laughs> Molly, you're eating the snacks as quickly as Mom and I can bake them. Well, 
I guess maybe you should bake a little faster. Daddy, those are the snacks for a sleepover. Yeah, Molly, the sleepover hasn't even started yet, and you're already mowing down on all the snacks. I can't help myself. Mmm, this is so good. These chocolate chip cookies are the best you've ever made, Mom. Oh, thank you, honey. But seriously, stop now before you eat them all, and you get a stomach ache. Me? Never. I got a stomach ache that's as strong as a billy goat. <laughs> oh, really? I never heard you say meh. Oh, really? Watch this. <laughs> Perfect. I got all the snacks I need. <laughs> Here comes Jade. Hi, Jade. Welcome to my first ever sleepover. <laughs> Whoa, look. You got lots of snacks. Wow. I'm so excited to be here and have all of you here, too. Whoa, these hot dogs are really good. I'm really hungry. Let's jump on the bed. That'll be so fun. Wee! Come on, guys. Wee! I don't know what time I'm supposed to. It's a sleepover. You can do whatever you want. Wee! Wee! I have to go potty. I'll be right back. Hi, too many hot dogs. I have to go potty. <laughs> be right back. Bye. You can bake soon, Tyler, and then we have more sleepover fun. What is that racket? <gasps> what? Where did all these kids come from? Baby Kira, what's happening? <laughs> I had a sleepover on my own with my friends from daycare. I had a sleepover on my first sleepover. Baby Kira, you didn't even ask me if you could have a sleepover. Yeah, I did. And you said no. You always say no. Mommy and Daisy get to do everything. I too little to do anything. I just feel so sad. Oh, sweetheart. I didn't know that that was so important to you. Can we stay, please? I want to stay at the deep over place. My mom's not coming back till tomorrow. Well, I guess since everyone's already here, and what? You took some of the snacks from your sisters? <laughs> I want to have a good deep over, too. Oh, honey. Well, okay. Everyone can stay. Hey, yay! Wait, what? You get to have a boy at your sleepover? I don't get to have boys at my sleepover. <laughs> I like my sleepover better than yours. <laughs> ha ha, my sleepover is amazing. Oh, uh, baby Kira, can I have a few of your snacks? No, get out. You already ate all your snacks and it's my sleepover. And only for real kids. You're a big kid, so you're not allowed. Wow, I feel so left out. What game should we play? It's your sleepover. Why don't you tell us, baby Kira? I think we should play truth or dare. How do you play truth or fair? Dare? Is it fair or dare? Really? Have you been living under a rock? Deepest title. Are you playing by basically do what we did the wall? Are you playing by someone says truth or deal, but we did well, yeah? And you have to decide if you want to tell the truth about that question or if you want to do a deal. Oh, whoa, that sounds crazy. So who goes first? She should go first. It's her sleepover. Okay, I want to ask, um, Jay, uh, Truth or dare? Uh, truth! Is it true that you're not fully potty trained? What? That's not a nice question to ask! No, it could be any question. My big sister's playing this game, I know. I, I have to tell the truth? Yeah, you do! Are you not potty trained? I'm not totally potty trained. So embarrassed! Ooh. I'm not sure I like this game. Seems kind of crazy. Okay, you're not. Truth or dare, Tyler? Um, I pick dare. I think you go all the way downstairs for more hot dogs, but the floor is lava. What? That sounds crazy. I know, it is crazy. That's why it's a I don't want to get burned 
I'm not a grown up. You are to me, which makes you boring. I'm not boring. Okay, the floor is lava. Oh, it's too hot, too hot. Oh, you fell in the lava, you little kid. You, you lose. <laughs> what? No, I didn't lose. You just, you didn't see me with my magic shoes that are lava proof. <laughs> the imagination of little kids is so amazing, but it doesn't really explain why I'm standing on the counter. I guess I just wanted to act like I was a little kid for just a minute. Yeah, right. You're a big kid, which makes you boring. <laughs>